Hi, greetings from a cloudy day in Melbourne. Um, looking forward to the winter passing soon. Um, I just want to say, first of all, congratulations on getting through the orientation and, and getting things set up for the course. Um, I know it can take a little bit of time, so I hope it, um, hope it all went well. If not, let me know and we can make sure that things are on track so you're not messing around with this stuff uh, as we get into the lessons. So here we are at the beginning of lesson one. Um, I just wanted to sort of touch on some of the main things we'll be covering uh, this week. Um, most of what we're going to be doing is really background stuff on um, emergency management, on uh, spatial data science, and how the two sort of come together. So this is stuff we're going to be building on the whole course. So um, uh, so you have plenty of time to sort of work through the ideas and get, the, get your head around them. We'll start with uh, some of the core concepts around how emergency management is, is uh, considered. So uh, things like uh, the, the stages of disaster management from from response to recovery to preparedness and the like. We'll then talk about some of the emerging um, trends in geographic information science and geography and geospatial. It's all sort of talked about in some different ways. Um, but then narrow it down to what are the implications for emergency management of these things. We'll talk about um, emerging themes and uh, this week we'll provide a bit of a, of a background for and a listing, I guess, of all the topics that we'll be covering um, as we go through the course. Then you'll transition into uh, a more focused consideration of some of the emerging ways that we're interacting with technology. Um, and some of these are, um, again, quite familiar. Others are going to be a little bit different and maybe, um, maybe we're not quite there yet, technologically speaking, but they're on the horizon. You'll take the material from the uh, emerging themes and uh, bring that into a discussion and we'll, we'll see how that goes. We'll get everybody sort of going and on the right schedule with, with, uh, with uh, developing some, some ideas there. The final thing is a set of readings and um, uh, I've actually changed these recently. Um, before the focus was really more on sort of industry and, and government perspectives on geospatial. But what I've tried to do is add a few papers that deal more with um, the sort of the, the spatial big sci big data science or sorry I said kind of mix, missed that up the uh, spatial data science or, or big data um, ideas that are um, kind of taking hold um, so so that you can sort of see how some of the technological issues we will deal with sort of fit in with um, with some of these broader technological changes and the like um, right, so we'll end with um, a bit of a discussion around the term project, so that will be introduced, and you won't have to do anything really heavy this week on that, but the idea is to get, a, get your head around the topics and sort of what you might want to do. You know, do you want something that's a bit more um, uh, sort of technical, and, and you're going to need data, and you need to figure out where you're going to get it, that kind of stuff, or whether you really want to do something more at a higher level that maybe speaks to you know something you're doing at work or, or whatnot. So um, anyway, so you get to get a chance to sort of think about that and, and for me to help clarify any any issues and um, any of the parameters around those assignments. Okay, well, um, the actually the final thing I would just mention is that um, as we go through this course, we're undoubtedly going to encounter different um, natural disasters or, or, or human related disasters that are occurring around the world. So um, to the degree that you can, it'd be great to if you could sort of pay attention to what's going on and uh, think about how the concepts that we're covering sort of play out in the real in the real world, uh, particularly with, you know with regards to the um, the resources that are available for for responding to them. How, how that how that varies. I mean, you know um, how how well are sort of uh, hurricanes and the like being addressed in the United States versus typhoon typhoons in other parts of the world. So. Uh, just try to develop this sort of comparative view uh, because there's certainly going to be lots of different disasters unfolding um, while we while we go through this course, unfortunately. So, okay, well, have a good week and feel free to get in touch anytime. And uh, yeah, have a good time.